All right, hey guys, um, this is gonna be a review of the Kershaw Barrage. Um, the blade is Sandvik 14 C2 8 in steel. It's the blade seal. Uh, combo edge. I got this for my birthday. Uh, my dad got it for me at Walmart because I told him, hey, I want a Kershaw knife because I didn't have one in my collection at that time. So there's one at Walmart, just to let you know, just in case you ever decide to go get me a Kershaw knife at Walmart. So here it is. Um, like I said, 14C28N Sandvik blade steel. The handle is 410 steel with track tech inserts. Um, it is very, it's a very thin knife altogether. It's perfect for an EDC knife for me. I carry this every day when I go out somewhere. Um, the blade is three and a quarter inches. The um, closed it is four and three eighths of an inch just like that. Um, <clears throat> it weighs about five ounces so it's pretty light. You don't even fill it in your pocket really because it's so thin and light. And it's made in the USA. That's important to me anyway. I mean not saying I don't like China knives or Taiwan knives but made in the USA just seems quality to me. Uh, the model number is 2445ST. Pocket clip is very nice. Short, I like short pocket clips. Ooh, just cut myself. Ooh, just cut myself. Ooh, just cut myself. Very nice. Short, I like short pocket clips. Ooh, just cut myself. Um, short pocket clip. Um, real loose, slides in and out of the pocket real nice. And, um, it's a frame lock. I was wanting to say that earlier and then I forgot and then I said it was, uh, so I started talking about the pocket clip. But you can move that pocket clip down to there for tip down or tip up carry. Depending on what your, uh, choice is. You gotta excuse my lighting guys, um, I really wanted to make a video, but I decided to make it outside and it's getting dark and lighting would have been even worse outside, so, gotta do what you gotta do, um, you can see the knife I guess, so, thanks for watching, peace.